Police officer Sandra Liddy injured her knee so badly in a training exercise that it left her unable to do her job. So she turned to Dr. Jamie Hernandez for a brand new technique in knee replacement surgery. I have been a Los Angeles police officer for 24 years. 17 years ago, I was assigned to riot control training where I fell on my knees, had pain on my knees, noticed abrasions, but didn't think anything of it. Over the years, the pain got worse. It was stabbing pain, clicking pain. I couldn't sit, I couldn't stand. The doctor said I needed orthoscopic knee surgery because of the torn meniscus. After the surgeries, the pain never went away. The doctor prescribed physical therapy, painkillers, injections. My life was just basically pain, pain, pain. And so they finally said, you need total knee replacement. And that's when they referred me to Dr. Hernandez. Looking at her knees and looking at her x-rays, what she needs are two mm -hmm. knee replacements. Luckily for her, we are able to take advantage of new technology. So what we're gonna do is essentially a GPS system for the knees. It maps out the patient's specific anatomy that allows me to know exactly what's going on with the shape of her knees so that I can place her components perfectly. The first step of the surgery is to allow the computer to collect information about the patient's knee. And these computer trackers here send off information to the computer, where the hip is, where the knee is, and where the ankle is. These dots are basically mapping out the front of her femur. Once the computer has this sizing information, it'll give me recommendations on what size fits her knee best. There's 11 landmarks throughout the femur, which is the, the top bone, and then the second bone is the tibia, and we have to register that next. And once we get done with the tibia, you go down to the ankle. The second step is to put in this smaller microchip pressure sensor. So with this information, I'm able to adjust the pressure to get it to that perfect snugness that I want. After we double check all the implant alignment and numbers and angles and pressures, we cement the metal parts and plastic pieces in there and we stitch her back up. Dr. Hernandez and Officer Liddy are joining us, and uh, what a fascinating surgery. Everyone and okay in the audience after watching that? Fascinating. <laughs> and, 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 and I think what it does is, you know, technically when we think of a knee replacement, we think you just go in and put a new knee in and everything's fine, but what you're actually doing is making a custom fit knee replacement <laughs> based off of this GPS technology. It's fascinating. Right, exactly. The technology allows me to know exactly where to put the implants so this is basically how it works so these are the parts that sandra has in her knee the trick is how do you get these pieces in there exactly to fit her knee perfectly and that's where all this computer stuff comes in <clears throat> so we have these two trackers that i place around the knee and with the information that th these two collect and that tells me how to line all these parts up and this is a little pressure sensor one of the most important parts about a knee replacement is getting the how tight or how loose your ends up being. People don't want their knee flopping around or their knee's too stiff where you can't move. So uh, in the past, what we would do is, is, is feel the knee and kind of kind of just get a little little jiggle and mm, that feels pretty good. <clears throat> um, but this one... Oh, no. <laughs> I'm wondering. So now you so can now, use so that pressure use this thing and to get a sense exactly. if it's the right so it, fit. It tells me the numbers. It tells me the rotation. It tells me exactly where this piece is touching this piece. In the future, I think next year there's going to be a smartphone app so you can do <laughs> it's, it's ser Seriously, this, this thing is going to be able to detect when something goes wrong. It will text the doctor when something's happening wow. to, the, to, the, uh, to the parts. And absolutely, how long ago was that? I had this one done five months ago, and I this one had done a month ago today, exactly. A month. A month. And? and? How do you feel? And I love it. My pain has gone away, mm -hmm. and it's great. It's a great thing. I'm telling you, he's a miracle worker. Can you show us off and get a little strut? Like, when you walk now, everything's sure. just, is it like pain? Like, nope. no pain? No, you know, before I used to actually limp, and because of the pain was so sure. bad, now I actually, he's even surprised that I'm walking, you know, Kind of cool. Kind of mm -hmm. just Love really, it. kind of nice. We do unfortunately have to go to break. Dr. Hernandez, thank you for sharing this with us. And we are so happy. Thank you. Thank you. And thanks for your civil thank service you. that you give us every day.